today in my video, I'm going to talk about the types of people that you just can't trust. I mean, everybody knows that they're out there, everybody knows who they are. I'm just going to be the first one to come out and say them on the interweb. I just said interweb. First type of people that you just simply can't trust are people that don't like chocolate. No. Please stop. You like chocolate. You know you do. And I, I now cannot trust you because you just lied about liking chocolate. Probably like some skinny model or like somebody like preppy that doesn't want to eat food. Ugh, I don't like chocolate. I can't trust you anymore because now I don't know if anything that you say or anything that comes out of your mouth is going to be a lie or not. Because the fact that you said that you don't like chocolate, that's a lie. I'm just... It's a lie. Moving on. People who spend all day at the gym. Have you ever gone to the gym and it been like an hour and a half of you just like lifting weights and running and you know working out and whatever like getting on your elliptical like getting it going and then you're just like worn out after an hour and a half or like or if you just like go on a run for an hour or something like that and think about people who do that for like six hours a day. That is like too extreme for me. Like I, I don't trust you because you've, you're probably on steroids or something that I don't know about. And you probably are like superhuman, built, extremely strong. Why did I do that? People who like you have seen them like in their out, like normal outfits and everything, and they wear something different every single day. Like. Like, I know you wear something different one week, and then you don't wear the same stuff the next week, and then you might, like, wear the same pair of jeans or something again, but, like, these are the people that you have never once seen them wear, like, the same shirt, ever. Like, you see them wear it once, you're like, oh, that looks good on you, wish you would wear it more than once. Like, these are the people that never, like, they, like, buy something and they wear it once and then they like throw it away I don't know like how how is it not just like sitting in your closet like tempting you like wear me wear me wear me wear me wear like there's clothes screaming wear me out where people in white vans that's self-explanatory you know people who say they want to grow up and be a bus driver or a janitor or work at McDonald's. What is in your mind that makes you want to do that? I either want to be like a director or work with like photographer. Not, oh wow, but like a director or work with photography and like movie making and everything. Or I want to be in the medical field and I want to be a dermatologist or an anesthesiologist. I don't know what, what is going through your head when you thought, hey, you know what? For the rest of my life, I want to drive snot-nosed kids to school while they throw paper in my head and beat me up, apparently. No. I don't trust you. People who sneeze like a baby kitten. You just need to let it out. Just You just need to release the Don't hold it in. It, like, especially when guys do this, because I can't tell if it's like their actual sneeze or if they're holding it in. Because when girls do this, it's like, oh yeah, you're trying to be like all preppy and cute and everything. Well, it, yeah, whatever. It kind of works. You know, I'm jealous of you. You can sneeze like that. I, I'm just like, <gasps> Who you are? Are you holding it in? Or do you actually sneeze like that? People who are always busy. You text them and you'd be like, hey, can you hang out tonight? Or hey, you wanna go see a movie? Busy. They don't tell you like what they're doing. They're just like, I'm busy. Basically, you know, that's what they say. And every single time, like, they're just always busy. And I'm like, I know what you're doing. You're busy planning this secret and corporation with the FBI to destroy all of America. That's what you're doing. That's, you're busy. Cause you, nothing takes up that much time. Like, like I've known you for four years and not once have you been free. People who like the show Criminal Minds. I think this is a little bit self-explanatory, but for people who don't know what Criminal Minds is, which all of you hopefully do, because it's like a really popular show. I don't like it. I tried to watch it for a while and it's 
weird. Basically, it's like all of these just murder stories and they're just horrific and they're not like normal murder stories like bang, you're dead, ha, huh, I killed you, bang, bang, like, or like, they're like, I'm gonna hold you hostage and then cook you over a fire and feed it to my witch friends. They're like that type of freaky stories. And so I'm not down with that type of stuff. That type of stuff kind of creeps me out. I'm not gonna be able to sleep tonight just talking about it. I'm getting chills. <laughs> so that was my list of people that you just thoroughly cannot trust because they have serious character flaws or things about them that would lead you to think you're in the FBI, plan to bomb America. You throw your clothes away and are extremely rich, but make me pay for the popcorn at the movies. And if you like my videos overall, you should hit the subscribe button because I post videos every Monday slash Tuesday, you know, depending if I want to stay up late and wait for it to upload. Thank you for watching.